Here we are, part two of my video. PS Plus versus Xbox Live Gold. And why PS Plus is the better deal and why it's better in general. So, as you guys saw in part one, it was just uh, cut off there. Uh, here's part two. Uh, let's continue off from where I left off. So, as I mentioned uh, in uh, towards the end there. So, right now, in comparison, it's Xbox Live Gold. 12 months is $59.99. PS Plus is four nine 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 for twelve months, and right now they do have the promotion that ends until uh, I believe November the eighth. I believe. Um, actually, no. It says October 29th is when it's going to be ending. So, yeah, if you purchase the twelve months before that, you'll get ten bucks in your PS and wallet uh, by the launch of even before the launch of the PS4. It says uh, November eighth. So essentially, you're getting it for thirty nine ninety nine at this time, in this moment in time. But the regular price is four nine nine nine. So it's ten bucks cheaper than Xbox Live Gold, and it includes right now twelve hit P games for PlayStation Three and six for PS Vita. Uh, new games every month. You know, there's discounts, like real discounts too. I mean, I'm talking about like games like fifty percent off. I've seen games like they say seventy five here. Um, you know, they're actually saying seventy five percent off of uh, games. But I've seen some, you know, that's actually legit. It's not like some fake stuff that they say, like with Xbox Live. I mean, these are actually like new games, you know, that I saw in there that were on sale for really good prices. Um, I would say that the only thing that Xbox did to come close to that was their summer sale event uh, this year that actually was, was, pretty, def was pretty decent. Um, but for the longest time, they weren't even doing it. And, and that's only just for the one summer sale. I mean, everything else after that has been garbage, though. Um, so, yeah, there's instant game uh, collection. So you also get 18 games, you know. So you guys will see everything there, all the accolades. pretty hilarious. And uh, other features. <clears throat> so we have automatic updates. So this is actually pretty cool. I, I use this on mine. Uh, where it updates the games, you know, on its own, the firmware, and so this is something that you'll experience with the PS4. Um, you know, that's going to be on there. You got one gig of cloud uh, save data, so essentially it's like same thing with the Xbox One, where you can access your game saves anywhere. Same thing with this. If it's if it's a digital game, you can access it anywhere, and your save information is on there. Full game trials. I mean, this is actually one thing that I think is pretty cool that the Xbox One X and 360 don't have is this full game trial. So you actually play a game uh, for up to one hour, the full game, absolutely full game. Uh, any achievements, uh, or sorry, any trophies that you get uh, in it, it will be carried on when you purchase the game. And yeah, it's pretty cool. There's also beta access on there. So yeah, it's pretty much everything for the PS Plus. And so as you guys can see, some more games. I mean, some really hit games here, like Grandma Origins on the Vita, Uncharted, Gravity Rush on the Vita, one of the best games of this uh, gen in my opinion. And uh, I'll show you some more of the PS Plus games here. So this is for year one. So look at this. <laughs> this is all from year one from June 12th uh, up until so June 12th, 20, 2012 up until May 2013. So I had this uh, at launch when the PS Plus, when I first heard about it, I'm like that's what really got me uh, you know, starting to uh, get into the my PS3 some more, uh, besides the exclusive games like Infamous 2. Uh, but yeah, look at all these ton of games. You know how much money like <laughs> this is. <laughs> uh, I mean, Infamous 2, Just Cause 2, Virtual Fighter Showdown. Like, you know, these are some big games. Little Big Planet 2, The Walking Dead 1 and 2. Um, you got Borderlands, Double Dragon Neon. That's when it first came out, Double Dragon Neon. I remember all of these games when it came out. So, so Double Dragon Neon came out, and it was free. Virtual Fighter came out, it was free right away. Uh, you got Resident Evil Gold, you got Super Street Fighter on there. Retro City Rampage is another one that came out, and it was free. Um, I mean, there's a ton of games, like Ninja, Ga Ninja Gaiden Sigma on the Vita, and Spec Ops The Line. ton and ton of games there. And so you got all that for four nine nine nine, or even three nine nine nine, or four nine 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 plus three months of uh, free, you know, free PS Plus. So and you know, so with uh, the advantages with the with the PS uh, Plus, because before this wasn't really relevant, I would say an argument between PS Plus and Xbox Live Gold, because there were sort of two different services. 
Uh, PS Plus, you know, wasn't required to go online to face people and, uh, you know, to face people online. But now it is for PS4. So that's why I want to do this video because now it's like you actually have to, to get it. <laughs> and, you know, before you didn't have to get PS Plus to play online against people on PS3. Uh, and uh, so now you have to do it with PS4. So looking at Xbox Live Gold and Xbox One versus PS Plus and PS4, I mean, it's a no-brainer. <laughs> uh, it's cheaper. And also, if you do have a PS3 and a Vita, and you get a PS4, uh, so like myself, that's going to be me. I'm going to be in that boat where I have all three of the systems. Um, I'm going to be getting free games for you know for all three of them every month. So that's a lot of content. Sleeping Dogs is, is on here. I, sorry, I just noticed it there. <laughs> uh, you know... So this is, this is some pretty big games. I mean, you know, the next year coming up too, they might even give The Last of Us. Who knows? They give Uncharted 3. That's on there. So The Last of Us, I wouldn't be surprised. That'd be pretty, that's pretty, uh, pretty convincing. But yeah, so you pay 4 9 bucks, and you get all those games covered for the PS Vita, your PS3 and PS4. And compared to Xbox One, you'll pay Xbox Live Gold to face people on your 360 and your Xbox One and to have access to certain apps and that's it. And those same apps are going to be free to access on the PS4 and they're free to access on the PS3. You know the game DVR that's going to be free and it's actually more I believe it's 15 minutes or 10 minutes on the uh, on the PS4 that you can record so there we go it's already that's <laughs> that already you know blows them out of the water there and um, yeah, I mean, it's really just just a multiplayer that that you know aspect is what it is, and it's really only for certain games. So some games are free to play, like Warframe, uh, Blacklight Retribution. You don't even need a PS Plus to play those games because they're free to play. Uh, on Xbox Live or Xbox One, sorry, you'll need to have uh, Xbox Live Gold to play those free to play games. So, you know, it's just this is just something that I think needs to be in a spotlight where as a consumer. If you're sort of stuck on the fence between getting a PS4 and Xbox One, I hope this and my other videos sort of, you know, educated you and uh, shown you, you know, basically what is a good decision, <laughs> uh, in my opinion, you know, because they both have pretty much the same games. Uh, but in this particular video, this is about PS Plus versus Xbox Live Gold. PS Plus wins, hands down. There's not, not even a competition. I mean, Xbox Live Rewards Program is nothing like, not, not even close. So, yep, that's all I just wanted to show you guys there. So, hopefully, a lot of people that didn't know this know this now. And hope you guys enjoy the video. Please check out my other videos as well about the PS4 versus the Xbox One. About the, I did one on the video store, uh, sorry, the video game store, uh, as well as the user interface where I showed my PS Vita. Uh, interface and uh, yeah thanks guys please comment and rate and have a good one Harukin.